Hi, we're Nigel and Jan from Boat How To, and we're very excited because we're now finally launching our diesel engine maintenance course. So Nigel, what are we going to cover in this course? Well, first of all, the overarching goal here is to make sure that people don't have problems with their engines so they can enjoy their boating. Uh, so in order to do that, we, we have a certain amount of uh, education on how a diesel engine works because we think that's important for understanding the maintenance, why you have to do it, and also for troubleshooting. And then we get heavily into the maintenance side of both traditional diesel engines with mechanical injection systems and also modern diesel engines with electronic injection systems. And we go through in considerable detail all of the core maintenance that we think uh, a talented boat owner can carry out without having specialized knowledge, but we also identify those components that we think you should leave alone unless you have that specialized knowledge. Because we do have on all of our engines, even some of our older engines, some pieces of kit that you fundamentally should leave alone unless you've been trained to work on that piece of equipment. In this course, we combine theory and practice. Part of it is recorded here aboard my boat, where I will guide you through the lessons. I will give you important background information and explain the theory with animated graphics. But for the practical part, it is best to show things on actual engines. We were lucky to get the opportunity to film in the workshop at the German Boat Building School. There we have a variety of different engine models to play around with. So during the lessons, we will switch back and forth between the studio here and the workshop where Nigel will show you some tricks he learned during the 40 years he's been working on diesel engines. Actually, it's more like 50 or 55, <laughs> a 60 actually. <laughs> <laughs> well, you see, Nigel has an incredible wealth of knowledge that we are able to tap into during this course. Well. I must admit that before we started working on this course, I didn't know much about my boat's engine. I did regular oil changes, but that was about it. Apart from that, I was just hoping that my engine would not let me down. For example, I did not have the confidence to take apart my heat exchanger to check for scaling. Partially because I didn't know how and partially because I was afraid I would not be able to get it back together. For far too long, my motto with my engine was, if it ain't broken, don't fix it. But that is bad advice when it comes to boat engines. Instead, your motto should be, do preventive maintenance before anything goes wrong. The last thing you want is your engine failing you a few meters from the harbor wall in heavy seas. Luckily, during the production of this course, I learned so much that I now not only know exactly how my engine works, I also know how to make sure it stays healthy and reliable. And I have the confidence to do the necessary maintenance myself. I'm sure you will get the same level of confidence if you take this course. No matter whether you're a total beginner or whether you want to brush up your engine skills and profit from Nigel's immense knowledge and expertise. I can tell you it's really satisfying to increase your level of self-reliance. And as an added benefit, working on your engine yourself will save you thousands of dollars that you would otherwise have to pay for a mechanic. This not only goes for regular maintenance, but also in case you run into problems with your engine. So, uh, and also we do get into troubleshooting, uh, simple troubleshooting that uh, most boat owners can carry out. And most of which will, will uh, identify problems on boats. There are not many problems that you're likely to have that we don't cover. But it, once again, we get into that stuff that you shouldn't fool with. Uh, and, and ideally, you won't have to do any troubleshooting. If you set the engines up properly in the first place and you do the maintenance that's required, uh, diesel engines are remarkably reliable. They'll run thousands of hours without giving any problems. So that's the primary goal, to make sure you don't have any problems. And then the secondary goal is to give you some simple troubleshooting techniques that uh, may help if you do have problems. Check out our course at boathow2.com and we hope to see you soon in class.